Hey, it's JC1424 once again with NASCAR Heat Ultimate Edition. Plus, and in this episode of our season, as Justin Allgaier is number seven, Brant Chevrolet, we're going to do the first round of the Xfinity Series playoffs, which I believe is the round of 12. Yes, yes it is. So four drivers will get eliminated at the end of this video. Right now, Michael Annette, Daniel Hemrick, Josh Baligi, and Vinny Miller are below the, the playoff cut line. But see, Baligi got in here because he won Daytona. Vinny Miller must have won something because I don't think he ran that well this season. Josh Williams won two races. And Jeremy Clements, maybe he won something, but I think he's been mildly consistent. Alex LeBay has been good. Brand Jones, Harrison Burton, you know, all these guys up top, they've just definitely been really good. Because they probably get to start up here because of how well they've run the season with stage wins and shit. But uh, first race, Bristol Night Race, I'm going to use the, the red car. I've decided to dress stupid in this video because this is the playoffs. And the playoffs are stupid. So why not dress just like it? So let's, let's get at uh, whatever that is. Uh, no, no, no practice. Cancel the practice. Let's just go to the qualifying. Yeah, make it count. You give us one lap. I won so many damn races. I probably got a full race lead as soon as we start the dang playoffs. It has to be an absolute disaster for me to not make it to the final four at this rate. 16.2, it's like half a second off. Okay, ninth. Now I am eighth. Somebody got sent to the tail of the field. Start race. No, we don't need to look at all this. Yeah, it's night race, so it's it's sunset right now. So I am just going to show you this first lap, and then anything else worth watching. But, you know, we're going to have three races in this video. I'm going to try to make it quick. I'm on the outside. I don't want to go the outside of this guy. It'll be three wide. I'm bouncing off of Oh my god. What are you doing? Get dumped. I hate you. Stupid Chase Briscoe. Fucking sitting in the way. Couldn't even make it one fucking lap because of that prick. I just lost spots to start because of that. If I was clear on the bottom, wouldn't have to be bouncing off of the wall and bouncing off a car and bouncing off another car. Got 20 laps in this first stage. I'm on the apron. I probably shouldn't do that. Okay, now we're doing business. I make even more passes. Yeah, but it's Bristol. You've seen the Bristol race. You, you get what's going to happen. Got stupid dang lap cars slowing down these people in front of me. Making it easy to gain some positions late in the stage. Maybe like third out of this. Well, I could have gotten third. And instead, I'll just get fourth. Okay. Car gets tied off the corners, but I don't give a crap. I mean, I got top five speed. Good enough. Uh, Justin Haley wins the stage. Fuck you, Justin Haley. Um, okay, yeah, yeah, there's the results. Head down pit road, fix that damage for the heck of it. Uh, one can will fill it up. And I lost a spot. Good, I don't want to come to this restart on the outside. That was awful. So now it's not... Sunset anymore. Now we're more in the the night ishness. Night ishness. It's 18 laps in the second stage. So I think we'll still wind up having enough time to to win the stage because of lap traffic. We cut some laps out of the first stage because Chase Briscoe's an idiot. There is the first lap of the second stage. So now I'm lapping all those cars I was talking about. Halfway through the second stage, this will show just how many laps were cut out of the first stage. Would you get off of me? I'm not really worried about anything anymore because, well, now I am because freaking caution came out. I'm getting points and I have a full race lead, so like, what the heck? He's working it on the inside. Oh my god, he just decided to drive right the fuck into me. I'm still to his outside. Oh, I got him loose off the corner because of that. Suck my ass. Why won't the car turn? Fuck you. I hate you. 
just, I don't know, freaking battle. You making content to put in the video. I don't want content in the video. I just want the video to be over. Because this concept of a championship sucks. Man, I just want to grind this guy into the wall. I'm trying to get the stage win. And I don't even know if we're faster than Daniel Hemrick because this guy's been all over my ass the entire stage. Sending it in. Gassing it back up. Ugh, not clear. Wish I was. Now I'm clear. Great. And now we're going to have one lap to go in the second stage, so, I mean, screw it. Guess I'll go ahead and uh, not cut all this shit out. Even though it's going to make the video like 15 seconds longer because it's Bristol. And that's what a lap at Bristol is. Well, Justin Haley got back around all those guys. Good for you. I hate you. <laughs> Give me my Pepsi. Yeah, this is like one week old Pepsi in the video. <laughs> hmm. This is the same Pepsi from last week's video being recorded on this same evening. So, we'll fix that second of damage for the heck of it. We'll get the four tires. And one can of fuel to fill it up. We have no green flag stops in the third and final stage. Michael Annette gained 20 spots. He pit, but he gained 20 spots. Well, now it is complete the entire nighttime. And I'm having a, a decent restart. We should clear Mike Lynette off the corner. And we do. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen eventually because they designed the track to, to be like that. I now have 16 seconds of damage and I'm not going to win and lock myself into the next round. Yeah, just get four tires. Full tank of fuel, repair all the damage. Um, Mike Lynette was third. He was first at the restart. But now he's third. I wish the car would stop doing that. I'm trying to send it and you need to stop doing that. Where's the caution game? Where's where's the freaking caution? Well, here's Michael Annette. Like about to start coughing up puke or bile or some shit. Got a big old giant traffic jam going on because someone's blowing up. And I am trying to push Michael Annette straight the heck through it. And the guy pulled off the track and he didn't gain anything. Instead, he just slowed me down. Ugh. You could be winning this race, but it's like you just decided to not do that. I'm just going to sit behind him and make sure that he gets his top five. I passed a lot of cars in the round of 12 on the way up here. So, yeah, he's definitely gaining points on all those other guys. So that's great. Uh, this race is almost over. We got a caution or something. I don't know. Maybe I could do something for him now that I'm up here. But, but no. Instead, I wrecked off the apron because I suck. Don't wreck your car, you idiot. I'm trying to not crash into him. Just, just pass the lap cars. Pass the lap cars. There you go. Vinny Miller. The, yeah, this guy's in the freaking playoffs, and he's 23rd because he just happened to win a race. I think you got to be in the top 20 for a win to count for the playoffs. Well, there's only 29 car field, so go figure. And that is the end of the first race of the round of 12. Chase Briscoe is your race winner. Speaking of whom we are watching him spin like a top. We've had a lot of that in this first race. Bup. Sixth place finish. Next up is Las Vegas for the Las Vegas 300. We raced there at the beginning of the season and we were okay. And all I have to do is be okay and all of these races to make it to the next round. Let's drive the other car. Uh, yeah, the gray one. So, 
Here we are in Las Vegas for qualifying. I'm just gonna run a nice lap. Or not, I could bounce off the apron. There's that too. Got a Ferris wheel over there. JC loves Ferris wheels. You know, this is only in this game, but I don't know why the pavement is like shiny and glossy. That's so weird. Like they waxed the pavement. We are over a second off the pole time. 14th. I've started 14th so many times in this season. I, I know that much. And uh, pole sitter is Austin Sendrick. I guess he's going to lock himself in. I feel like he makes it either way because he's just doing so much better than all these other guys in points. Did I drive this car in the first Las Vegas race? Or maybe I'm confusing that with the gray car that I dumped. I don't know. Ten laps in the first stage. I am going to go underneath Jesse Little. Ugh, I need to get up to speed so I can actually drive this thing the way I want to. Keeps oversteering and stuff. Michael Annette is up here in the top five. So, yeah. He should be fine. Should make the round of eight. Easy peasy. Women squeezy. Yellow polka dot bikini. Oh! Michael Annette took the lead. Sick. And they're uh, freaking past me because I don't have anyone to draft off of and hang with the leaders. Yeah, that concerns me later in the race. I didn't get to the line, but they, they ended the stage. You're only supposed to do that whenever the top ten gets there, so apparently we had a caution as the stage was ending or something. Okay, well, let's uh, you know, fix the damage. We'll get four tires. We're going to have to get two cans to fill it up. Okay. I gained a spot. Yay, I'm on the outside. Not really. I guess I'll show you first lap of this stage. That's how you gain all them spots is on the restart. And everything else just kind of deludes into people passing you because your tires are gone. And my tires only last like four laps or something. Um, how many laps you got in this one? You got ten laps in the second stage as well. Oh, now that the sun's going down, we have the stupid silhouette mountains over there. Good God! Okay, I, I don't want to take the, the lead from Michael and Ned. I wasn't going to anyways. I didn't have a run big enough for that. Oh, here comes Brandon Jones. He's going to steal it from Michael and Ned. We don't need that. Yeah, yeah! Block him. Feed the blocky pants. No, why are you leaving the bottom open? He's, he's just giving the, the win away. I am pissed off. And my tires are already gone. Like usual. Why are we three wide? Fuck you, Austin Sindrick. Fuck you. I don't want to be sitting here for two laps trying to pass your ass. Um. Can I get clear? No, I can't. I hate this shit. I hate this in the situation I'm in right now. I guess I'll just get freight trained again. Coming to the final lap of the second stage. I'm fast enough to compete with pretty much all these guys hanging out in the top ten. Then one guy gets my draft, gets a run, shoots me up the fucking track, and then I fall back and then have to get all my minimum all set up again. Just do something like that. Make that move. And I can't put my car where I want it to be. I want to sit my fucking face behind Chase Briscoe's ass. I don't want to be sitting here in the middle of the track, but I take a little right and then I hick it into the wall. I don't want to hick it into the wall. I just want to go up the track and sit behind his car. Something like that. But no, it's like, you can't just put... The, you can't just go from here to there. It you can't do that with this controller. You can't do that with the fucking blocky handling of the damn thing. Don't drive the way I want it to. And also don't have the grip that I want. I hate racing at this freaking track. It's too bumpy, not enough grip. Tires wear off immediately. I ain't got any damage. We'll get the four tires and we'll fill the tank again. So we're going to restart. Just like last time. We're going to 
flying past a bunch of these guys. And then we're probably going to have a green flag stop. I don't freaking know. What, what is it? You got 13 laps of fuel, and the stage is 26 laps. So and we'll be cutting it pretty close to make it on one stop right in the middle. And maybe I could win this race on pit strategy or something. I don't know. Big ol' run. Big ol' run. We're going to take the lead this time. We were going to, and then I ran clear out of grip in turn three. Austin Sindrick is just having this amazing restart, but he doesn't have that winning speed. Now Michael Annette's falling back. You were supposed to win the, the last stage, but you suck at leading, apparently. Uh, I, I need that draft. I need some grip. I need... Uh, there's a lot of things I need that I'm not getting from this car. Man, I about fucking had it with all these people pushing me out of the goddamn way! Uh, there's a caution, so that takes away the possibility of green flag pit stops. Of course it does. Um, no damage to repair. Gotta get four tires, otherwise they'll blow. And 1.5 cans will fill it up. I don't think we'll have an, enough fuel to actually make it to the end of the race still, because the stage is that freaking long. I gained a spot. That means that they all got tires like they were supposed to. So back to 13 laps on fuel again. 16 to go. I have like a little splash to go if they don't keep throwing cautions for whatever. Having that same old great restart. At, or, or I could do that. I don't know. I wanted to go beneath the cars. So now we're back to 13 laps of fuel again. And got 13 laps left. Okay, I have no control of my car. I can't hold my fucking line. I don't know what the heck is wrong with that guy. But I'm gonna rocket through the field, and they're gonna throw another caution. Just stop! Let's fucking race! Okay, I'm up. I'm in first now. I don't know! Lynette is leading, and I'm just sitting here in ninth, just like I have all freaking race long, because they always just push straight past me, they always have that draft that I lose because I run out of grip every corner, Yeah, there's the white flag, you better not freaking lose this race, Mike Lynette. like, he, he's got this all figured out, you just gotta... Keep leading. That's all you gotta do. And he just gave it away to Brandon Jones. Of course he did. Can you get it back, like, off the corner or something? Great job. Great job. Stupid fucking idiot. Apparently I've blown a tire. Of course I've, I've blown a freaking tire. Now my car is smoking. What? Do, what? I don't know. What the hell is wrong with this game? Yeah, yeah, yeah there's speed rating. So, Michael Annette... Chokes the freaking race away. This car sucks to drive at this track. Okay, let's, let's go on to the other race. Okie dokie then. On to the final race of the round of 12. It is the North Carolina Drive for the Cure 250 at the Charlotte Roval. So now that's going to actually be a fun track to drive. I, I guess. And uh, I haven't been looking like see who's below the cutoff line. But it is Daniel Hemrick, Josh Williams, Josh Balicki, and Vinny Miller. Well, I was expecting that from these three, but not Daniel Hemrick. Alex LeVay has actually been good this season. Uh, then you got Jeremy Clements that I don't expect that much from, but he's doing okay in points. And it's Any one of these random guys could wind up winning this race just because they're road course ringers, though. My outlap was fine. Just getting a feel for the car, trying to figure out like how tight it is, what it can and can't do. 
I hate the things that it can't do. Yeah, go figure. The pole lap time is a minute and 18.3 seconds, basically. No, stop that. It gets a little loose in one section. If I try to correct it, then it gets extremely tight. I hate this turn. I hate the way this car can't go through turns. You got that curb right there that I can't go over without spinning the car. Can't turn on it. Yeah, it's tight. If you go far enough to the outside and one of these curves, you wind up just getting it to turn a lot better off. Trying to hit that wall. Ugh! It won't freaking rotate. It, it's, it doesn't do that. No downforce package. Stupid shit. I want to hit the brakes at like the, the last white markers, like five of them or something. And right here. It won't slow down. That's not a penalty. I'm just hitting the brakes at the markers. And apparently your markers are not doing the trick. There's no other angle I can go in that corner and make that work. That's not legal, but as far as the game is concerned, it is. Okay, one more turn. The clock is ticking. We've got like four or three seconds left. Yeah, this is going to be way slower than the full time. Uh, four seconds? Yeah, four seconds slower. We're going to qualify in just where we usually do. Twelve. And your pole sitter is Chase Briscoe. He already won a race. Now we're 11. There were so many playoff drivers in front of us. Who is it? Uh, Austin Hill? Justin Haley? I, I think Justin Haley's in the playoffs. He's been good or whatever. Anyways, green flag is out. Three laps in the first stage. I forgot to put the relaxed yellows on, so I guess we'll just have to not wreck, right? That's very difficult whenever we... I send it in the corner, and then they send it in the corner harder. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna hang out, try to avoid hitting cars. Ugh, it's hard to whenever they won't gas it up off the corner. Get off of me, damn it. Alex will be over here. I was gonna send it underneath Josh Williams, but he cut me off. Oh, he's, he's hitting everybody. He's hitting me. He's hitting them. Oh, there we go. Oh, I should hit them cones. We're making moves. Do not hit that wall. Okay, up to nine. We have a ginormous breakaway for the top three. Do, 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 do. And I'm going to hit the brakes right there instead. A lot earlier. It's like they got the, the brake markers in the right place, but they didn't think about the fact that the cars can't actually do that with the physics. Would you stop bouncing off the fucking turtle? I had a great exit, and you bounced off the turtle. That's not how physics work. Not that goddamn bouncy. Ugh. Okay, let's gain right back up on them. There we go. There we go. And that is our first lap. This freaking Michael Annette. Just, just go. I, I don't need anything. I just need to run the race. I'm going to let by one car, not two. Okay, let's try to get back from him right here. Yeah, we'll get back into the top ten. I am going to try to make it easy for Michael and Nett to make up positions. Uh, can't believe Anthony Alfredo didn't make the playoffs. Stupid. Freaking stupid. What are you doing? You ended the stage early. I don't know what that was. He tried to go to my outside. There's no room there. That corner sucks because this game is physics engine does not support the curves. And he's just I don't know, he's trying whatever that is. Stupid Alex Obey. Why do we have to restart sideways? I they they don't even do it like that in reality. They ignore the first freaking chicane. They just drive straight and have a really fast restart and all that. Okay. So you know Michael Nets getting some stage points. He's making some moves right here. I I'm going to try to help him out. 
Yeah, get a little shove. No, don't wreck the car. Just, just go forward. Yeah, there you go. Now I'm going to make sure that he can move forward. You can do this. I mean, he's, he's got it on his own. He's got it all on his own. I got Josh Balicki for you. Oh, and he's got these two cars. He has to make it three wide to make the move. Chase Briscoe still dominating this thing. About to win two races in one round. How are you passing me here? I'm getting the brakes according to what they're doing. And you're passing me, which means you're missing the corner just to pass me. It's not going to work. Won't rotate! Won't do the stuff that I want! Fuck! I hate being here. I want to start the Cup Series. Ugh. Let's just pass a bunch of people to freaking restart. Or we could just skip laps. I don't know what the caution's for. I don't care. And they keep throwing cautions. I don't know why. But they gotta be a caution for every goddamn thing. We're in overtime. We just started the stage. Of course we are. Mm. I hate I hate this. I hate the cautions. I hate I hate the racing. I hate the freaking terrible handling of the freaking car. Okay, guess he wants it to be three wide. I'll just drive to the middle then. I can do that. There's Vinnie Miller running in the middle of the field, just like me. Rotate. Stop letting people back by. Rotate. Rotate. Get the run off. I don't have the patience for this stupid shit. Race is too short. No matter how long I make the race, at 25%, it's still too short. So many freaking cautions, they just skip all the damn laps they can. This is so easy to pass these guys, but there's no room to do it. I, I've got like freaking fifth place speed or something, but I can never get there because I'm always, I pass somebody and they have to go pass me back. You gotta stick it in there. They don't go ahead and miss the freaking corner to do it. Still there. Like, I'm going to enter this corner just like they do. Okay. One of those guys probably trying to do something crazy. So, now it should be the, the white flag of the round into the round of 12. Well, we're all the way at 16. Oh, my God. They get on the brakes so early for this corner. Maybe that's why I always miss it. It's because the brakes don't work that well at this track in general. Okay, we're going to pass Jeffrey Earnhardt. Ugh, the freaking curbs are a doozy. Would you stop whipping out sideways? Fuck off. Bullshit. I would be in front of him right now if he didn't whip out sideways into the wall. It just does random shit. Terrible handling. Uh, I don't see Mike Lynette, so he must be running really well right now. I mean, they got like five, six cars in front of me. I think I see him all the way up there ahead of all these guys. Ugh, bouncing around, but we're ahead of Anthony Alfredo. Uh, so we're going to finish 13th. Unless one of these guys in front of us just blows up. I mean, I'm not going to cover a gap that big. I'm going to hit the brakes right there. Okay, that is how you make the corner without traffic to worry about. And then, yeah, the race ends early. Um, okay. I can't look at the results until I make the thumbnail. I guess that's a good thumbnail. You got me getting ready to help my teammate, Mike Lynette. And you can see it's the road course. And why is it so gray outside the track? Man, I don't know. But, yeah. Winner of this race is Alex LeBay. Oh my god, that just knocked somebody out because I I know he was losing points all race and then he wasn't the highest up. He was already going to make it in barely on points, but god dang. So here are the results. Hamrick is eliminated, Balicki, Williams, and Vinnie Miller.
Okay, so pretty much Evan, that was already below the cutoff line. Harrison Burton, 37 points above the cutoff line. I don't know where Alex LeBay was there in points because it gives him like the advanced thing. And the first race of the round of eight is Kansas. And then there's going to be Texas and Martinsville. So two speedways and a short track. As opposed to this episode, which was a short track, a speedway, and a road course. Wait a second, Texas? Didn't we already race at Texas twice this season? Okay, let me, let me see. Texas, Texas. Yeah, there's Texas. We won that. And there was other Texas race, and I won that. So, we have three Texas races. This track is fucking awful, and we race here three times. Two times for no reason. At least this one has a different race name. Good God. See you next time. That's that. And round of 12 over.